William Riggs was born on August 31st, 1899. Riggs was an author, poet, and playwright. He was born on a farm in Claremore, Oklahoma. His mother was one of Cherokee, and when he was two years old, his mother secured his Cherokee all in men for him. Riggs wrote 21 full plays and several short story poems and television scripts. He was educated at the Eastern University Preparatory School in Claremont, Oklahoma. Starting in 1912, Riggs graduated from high school in 1917 and traveled to Chicago and New York. He started working for the Adams Press Company in Chicago. He wrote for the Wall Street Journal. He also sold books at Macy's and swept out Wall Street offices. When he returned to Oklahoma in 1919, he wrote for the Oil and Gas Journal. While traveling to Los Angeles, Riggs worked as an extra in the theater and a copy editor at the Los Angeles Times, which published his first poem. Then Riggs entered the University of Oklahoma in 1920 and taught English there for one year. But Riggs did not graduate after he became ill. During his senior year, he then moved to Santa Fe, New Mexico for health reasons. However, in 1926, Riggs moved back to New York hoping to work in the Broadway theaters. His first major production was one act play, which was produced by the Santa Fe Players in 1925. He began teaching at the Lewis Institute in Chicago while continuing to write. In 1928, he received a John Simmons Fellowship and traveled to Europe. Then Riggs began writing his most famous play called Green Girl the Lilacs in the Cap du Lux, Magots, in Paris. He completed this play five months later in southern France. He then lived in Santa Fe, Los Angeles, and New York and he was a screenwriter for Paramount and Universal Studios. After serving in the military for two years, he worked on a historical drama for Western Reserve University and published a short story called You Been the Hound and the Hare in 1952 and worked on a novel set in Oklahoma. He moved to Shelter Island, New York after he started receiving a steady income when Green Girl the Lilac was adapted into a landmark musical Oklahoma in 1943. He died June 30th, 1954 on stomach cancer in New York City, Claremore, Oklahoma is home to the Lynn Ridge Memorial.